slow going really starts to take its toll on me. There's the sun and snow post holing every few feet. The weather changing every few minutes. It's been about five hours of going through this snow. It's been wonderful, but definitely getting tired as I'm starting to lose some light. I'll probably be most comfortable if I get ready to stop now, tamp out a flat area, set up the tent, and be ready to just bed down for the night. Well, here we are. Most of the way up Yamze Mountain. Um, got to be about 7 o'clock, so had a storm coming in. Snowed a bit. It's not bad out, and uh, decided it was good to take the time before it got too dark, set up camp. So here's what we've got, our tarp tent, and it is very lightweight, just 18 ounces. Snug as a bug in there for the evening, once I get in, and uh, That's the spot. set up from the evening before my campsite nice and comfortable my kitchen kind of stove area tamped out the ground to make sure I had a good flat spot to put up the tent and uh, weathered an inch or two of snow overnight so here's the site and uh, a good night a bluebird beautiful day so uh, time to head up Yamse Mountain and uh, enjoy it. As I got higher of course the snow got deeper but I hadn't seen any other activity. Very few birds until I came across a few of these tracks. I'm not sure if they were coyote or what but uh, a lot of running around here chasing something probably some type of dinner. I did see some snowshoe hare tracks as well. And uh, now I've gotten up to a point where I'm just about on the rim of the top of the mountain. So we're at about 8,700 feet. Atop Yamsey Mountain? Yes! 8,196 feet on a beautiful April day day before Easter and uh, feel good got up here right at noon right exactly what I wanted to all I gotta do is follow my tracks back down it was uh, eight and a half hours getting up over two days so uh, it's gonna be a little easier going down which will be nice beautiful vista from up here the valley and the springs that run off the top of this mountain shield volcano here absolutely gorgeous
Damn shame. 